Well, my next guest is giving us an inside look at how the justice system works. Please welcome Mr. Mark Garagos. Hey, how are you? Good to see you. Nice Good to, to see, see you, you too. Been a big Thank fan for a while. Me. Thank yeah. you for coming. Now, Chris Brown, who I knew you represented, he was in court this past Friday, I believe. With me. That's right. How's he doing? He's great. He's great. I, you know, the I've known him obviously since uh, he first came to me over the whole Rihanna case. Um, I've watched him over the last four years. I've talked with Rihanna about him, and she has seen, I have seen a monumental change in him. I adore his mother. She's put a Herculean effort into raising him, and I couldn't be prouder of him. I just, I just think he's accepted every, everything that's come at him. He's dealt with it. He's grown and matured, and as he would tell you, he's still making good music. What kind of message does it send that he is back with Rihanna, though? Well, I don't know. I, I, you know, that may be above my pay grade in terms of sending messages. Mm -hmm. I talked to her, I will tell you, in the last couple of months when she was in the office, the last hearing I went to, and, and had asked her, would you be here if he hadn't made the, done the work and made the change and gone through the programs? And she said, absolutely not. I mean, she's a strong, strong woman. Mm -hmm. This is not somebody who is, you know, just standing by her man. This is somebody who believes honestly he's put in the work, that he was young, that he made a horrible mistake. Uh, and she's not going to hold it against him, and I don't think anybody else should. I mean, what he has gone through at his age, I think, is, is a real tribute to him. Because you've, you've dealt with celebrity cases, is it easier or is it tougher as far as uh, the, the perception and getting, and getting your, for your no, clients? it's always, I always say, you know, the prosecutors or judges will always say, we don't want to treat this person any differently because they're a celebrity. God save me from equal justice because the celebrities always get treated more harshly. I mean, people will talk about, for instance, Lindsay Lohan, and that she's been treated so much differently. That case never would have, never would have been handled anywhere similar to the way it has been if her name had been Lindsay Lyon or something like that. It's just because of who she is. Does she deserve the punishment she's been getting, or is it, have they been too harsh on her? I think they, I mean, people will not believe this, but really have been too harsh. Her problem is not her criminality. Her problem is, obviously, substance abuse. Let me ask you, Mark, do you think AEG should be held partially responsible for Michael Jackson's death? I do. I do. Really? Yeah. I think, um, I think that some of the emails that have now come out in the civil case, that you didn't see in the criminal case, by the way, when they were prosecuting Conrad Murray, right. some of those emails and the fact that it's the kids, it's not the family who's in there, it's the three kids yeah. and Catherine is their guardian who are the plaintiffs. I think with the right jury, you may see an astronomical verdict. I, don't, I wouldn't be surprised by that at all. Wow. Thank you for watching Extra on YouTube. And for 24-7 updates on celebrity news, subscribe to our channel here, like us on Facebook here, or follow us on Twitter here. And if you <laughs> want your voice heard, leave a comment below. Where? Right there. <laughs>